Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video, and today I'm bringing us episode number two of Pack Squads. And last episode, uh, we won two games in a row, so we are on a two game win streak. We're trying to bring it up to a third game win streak and a fourth game win streak in this episode. Try to keep the streak alive so we can open up more packs to build this team to make it better. And the last episode, we picked up some pretty good players in Division 10. No superstars or anything, but we're just that much closer to getting that Division 10 title. And we can definitely do it in this episode if we can win two games in a row. So let's try to aim for that for this episode. And I'll quickly show you the team before we start because we do have a few new uh, debuts for our team. You'll see here we have uh, Curtis Lazar playing on that first line right wing spot. He's playing alongside with David Steckel and Jaden Schwartz. Uh, ben Smith, also a new pickup. He's playing alongside with Reed Boucher and Garnet Hathaway. On the third, we got David DeHarnay playing with Dravecki and Kellenberger. And then fourth line, not many changes other than moving down Santa Santala to the fourth line. He's playing alongside with Lapierre and Mutinin. So on the defense, we have a couple new pickups as well. Uh, we have Brodeen. Uh, we have Andrew McDonald. And I don't think Paul Martin is a new one. I could be wrong there. But uh, our defense, defensive core is definitely looking really strong. I think our lowest overall is 82. But still, we want to pick up some more offensive players, some more defensive players. So we want to win our next game for sure. So let's get right into it. Let's start off our first game. I'll meet you guys in there. All right, guys. So first game of the episode, this guy's got Forsberg, Kuznetsov, and James Neal on his first line. So... Definitely not as bad as the last guy we played in our last episode, but uh, let's get this game going. Let's try to get some early goals here. Oh, nice. Nice poke. Come on, let's counterattack here. Grab the puck. Down low. Peter Harold. Get it down to Javecki. In front to DRNA, and he makes it one to nothing. Oh, man, I've been struggling this game. So much lag. Every single 10 or 15 seconds, it'll just, like lag for like one second or so but anyways we get the lead one to nothing against this guy with a pretty decent team let's try to keep it up here all right so that is the end of the first period not too much commentary just because it's been lagging quite a bit and it just messes up my whole commentary so we'll see if it gets better in the second and third period but so far we are dominating this game let's try to keep it up in the second hopefully get another insurance marker Oh, what a save by our goalie, Mayer. Almost uh, got beat on that one T there, but let's see if we can bring up the puck. We are on the penalty kill. Pass it up to Drevecki. There you go. Right across to DRNA. Back. Oh, to Drevecki. Almost. Come on. Let's see if we can steal the puck on this uh, penalty kill here. Nope, nope. Get back. Get back. Make sure he doesn't get by. DRNA. Cronwell block it. Oh, what a save by Mayer. There you go, nice face-off win. Hathaway, oh man, we should have scored that one. Back to the point, he took another penalty, so it's a 5-on-3. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing, I should have passed it there. Uh, let's just get him out of position, seems like he's going to bite. Shoot, shoot it! Oh, Hathaway, my own guy got in front of the, the shot there and we blocked it, but... Alright, we got to score in this power play, 5-on-3 still. Let's try to do a stick lift. Come on, stick lift him. There we go, he did mess up on the... The face-off there. Almost scored against Braden Holtby. He's definitely bailing him out. Uh, in front. Nope. Boucher is forcing the play. Back to the point. Uh, let's walk in. There you go. Shoot. Oh, man. Hathaway couldn't tuck in the rebound there. Okay. It's now five on four. Back to the point. Cronwall. Let's step in. Slap it. Oh, Holtby. What a save. All right, 40 seconds left. Let's see if we can uh, generate a play here. Is he going to run at me? Come on, keep going, keep going. All the way through. Grab the puck. We still got the puck. Wow, and gets laid out. That was definitely going to happen, but three on two now. Where are my guys? Let's play some good defense here. Good save by our goalie, Mayer. There you go. We can win this. Pass it up to Mutinin. Go, 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 go. You got him beat. Got him beat, and shoot it. Oh, hopefully another save. My 60 overall guys cannot score goals, on especially Brayden Holpe, but three seconds left. Be careful, goalie. Don't let that go in, but we got uh, two seconds left. I'm pretty sure we're going to win this unless he takes like a slap shot all the way from his zone, but pretty good win for us. Win the faceoff back down low. Let's just play it safe, and we win with a score of one to nothing. So big win for us. We're on a three-game win streak. Uh, we're that much closer to that five-game win streak, so we can buy that special pack, but... We're that much closer as well 
to the Division 10 title. So there you go, 3-0-0 in the season. Take a look at the stats as well. 26-10 uh, to 10 in shots, 14 minutes time on attack to 4 minutes, so we played really well. Holby, first star, he made some big saves for him. They are an second star, and Mayer, our goalie, getting the third star. So, good game for us. Let's go ahead and buy that pack. Let's see what uh, new players we can add to the team. Alright, so let's go ahead and open up our packs. Uh, but someone in the comments last episode said that I should switch between the Series 2 packs as well as the Gold pack. So, I think that's a pretty good idea, so I get a mix of players rather than just all Series 2 expansion players. So, uh, since we are on a 3-game win streak, I'll open up one of the Series 2 packs. Uh, the 7500 pack and I'll open up two of the gold packs or equivalent to one of these gold plus packs so we'll first of all open up the series 2 expansion pack first just because uh, it only has one player in it. it let's save the better one for last but in this pack let's go ahead and skip and look at that an 88 overall rare player Jason Spezza that is a solid pickup for our team that's going to definitely add some depth to our centermen's but uh, we also get Kyle Brodziak, another 84 centerman. And we also have uh, David Schlemko, which I think can replace uh, maybe a Herald in our defensive spot. So let's go ahead and send those to our collection for now. And we'll go ahead and open up the 15k uh, pack. Hopefully we can pull out one of those defensive team of the years. Those cards are still out, but uh, we'll open that up. Let's see what we get. Open now. Come on, let's see something good. Jason Spezzo was a pretty good first pull for sure. Let's go ahead and just let it open up. Uh, Derek Brassard, we already have uh, Reed Boucher, which is a little unfortunate. But uh, Derek Brassard, another centerman that we can use on our team. Uh, Derek Dorsett, that could replace some players. Chris Russell, let's keep going here. Who is our next rare gold player? It's going to be Shane Doan, so not a bad player. So 286s, which we can add to the team. And that should replace some of the silver guys that we have so far. So... Not a bad bunch of players. We also have Ryan Clone there as well. A, a nice power forward for the left wing. So let's send those guys all to our collection. Add them to our roster. Let's see where they fit in. Alright guys. So we have added in the new players to the team. And already it looks a lot better for sure. A lot of the silver guys are gone. We're left with just gold players. So I will quickly run through the team. Just show you guys what I've built. So we got Jaden Schwartz. Jason Spezza, that new 88 overall pickup on our first line, playing alongside with Shane Doan. Uh, we got Curtis Azar, Derek Brassard, and Ryan Klo on that second. We have uh, David Dearnay, Ben Smith, and Kyle Brodziak on the third, as well as Dorsett, keeping in David Steckel for his face-offs for the penalty kill, as well as Reed Boucher on that fourth line. So, right, you can already see that our top three lines are pretty much all 84-plus overall, so that is pretty good Go heading into our next game. Uh, we also added in a couple new defenders, Chris Russell as well as David Schlemko into that third line uh, left defenseman and right defenseman spots, replacing a couple of those 82 overall players. So our team's looking a lot better. No goalie yet. We're still sticking with Mayer for the next game. So let's go ahead and start up our next game here. Let's try to get this win for the Division 10 title. All right, guys. So second game of the episode, he's got Kochekny, uh, Raf. Raphael on that uh, first line. I don't know who is on his right wing, sorry. Uh, but uh, this is a pretty big game. If we can win this game, we can not only uh, continue our streak to a four-game win streak, but we can also get that division title pack, which is pretty big. So let's get this game going. Let's try to score some goals here. Careful, Mayor. But uh, yeah, let's get this game going. Shane Doan. Get a low shot on net. Oh, Spezza. He was there. He could have definitely tucked that one in if it didn't hop on him there. But uh, good poke. Get a hit on him. Come on, play some good defense here. Alright, play some good defense here. Come on, don't let him buy. There you go, nice poke. Pass it up to Jason Spezza, the 88 overall pickup. I think he's going to be one of our better players on this team for a while. Couldn't uh, connect with that pass there, but come on, well, let's get back. Let's try to capitalize on this power play. Let's set it up. Alright, pass it right across to Spezza again. He's going to be our playmaker. Uh, let's uh, kind of drag him out a bit. Nope, curl back. Go Brodeen, go Brodeen, pass it to Cronwall, back to Doan, curl to Cronwall, right there to Spezza, pass it, Doan, what a passing play, and we make it one to nothing, just dragging him out, and that's how you do it on the power play, that's how you score some goals, and we make it one to nothing, still 10 minutes left in the first, let's keep it going. Alright guys, so that is the end of the first period, let's take a quick look at the stats, and we're definitely dominating him on the stat sheet there, 8 to 1 in shots. Four minutes time on attack to about two minutes. So 
Let's try to keep it up in the second and third periods here. Try to get another goal. Back to Spezza. Nice. Shoot it. Oh, man. Spezza could have gotten a goal there. But uh, let's pass it back down low to Spezza. Curl around the net. In front. There it is. Oh, big toe saved by uh, Domingue there. Pass it back. No. Couldn't get, a, get, couldn't get it to the defender. Come on, Smith. You can beat the defender. Cross in. Cross back out. Backhand it. What a goal by Smith. Does it all himself on the penalty kill as well. Get that second goal for our team. But that's a big goal to get. Especially this late in the second period. But uh, let's keep going here. Try to get some more goals. Oh no. The cross crease. Trying to uh, defend the cross crease there. But just couldn't get by with Cronwall. He was a little bit caught out of position. And... He makes no mistake there, making it 2-1. to one. Gotta get that goal back. Oh my goodness, turns me inside out. And he does tie up the game, which is pretty surprising. This guy's definitely not a Division 10 player, I can just tell. Just from the way he's playing, but he ties it back 2-2. Two two. We got 15 minutes left to get this back, this lead. Let's try to do it. Oh, come on. I was there with a poke. And he has so much momentum right now. He makes it 3-2. to two. I think we got to take a timeout or something. Because our lines are just so tired. Uh, let's, Anyways, let's keep going here. We got 6 minutes left. We got to tie this back up. Come on, let's counterattack. We don't have that much time left. Cut in. Sauce it. Chris Russell still has the puck. Shoot it. Oh, man. Come on. Our players are way too slow right now. Grab the puck. C Russell. Get into the zone, get into the zone. Low shot net. Go, 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 Klo. Uh, come on, where's the four check? I have it on full four check here. Klo, in front. Broussard ties it back up, making it 3-3. Three to three. Another late goal with 37 seconds left in the third. Oh, man, that is a huge goal for us, and we have our fourth line out there. Oh, man, let's try to bring it an OT and just try, uh, try to finish this one out. Oh, nice tie up. Lazar! Oh man, I almost went 5 full on the goalie there. Grab the puck, see if we can get some last second chances. No. Played hard defensively. Matt Martin, take him. McDonald. No, careful! Oh, that was a big save by Mayer there. Almost went in. Klo, get a shot on net. No. So it's going to OT, and this guy's definitely stepped up his game after letting in those two goals. Take a quick look at the stats here. 19 to 7 shots. 8 minutes time on attack is 6 minutes. So this time we're going to OT without a power play. Uh, so we'll see if we can try to generate some chances here. Try to get a goal. Oh, Spezza. Come on. Snipe it. Yes, what a goal by Spezza. Post in. And we win the game. Oh, man, this guy was a little dangerous because he wanted to get the possession of the puck so much. And uh, we did break him down in the OT. And uh, we continue our streak. We win the Division 10 title. And that also means we get a Division pack as well, which is really nice. So let's take a look at our uh, stats here before we go and buy those packs. But, yeah, let's take a quick look at the stats here. 20 to 7 in shots. Uh, 9 minutes of time on attack to 7 minutes. So we definitely dominated, but... Uh, I mean, he played really well in the second and third period, and he almost made the comeback there, which is pretty crazy. But uh, Jason Spezza getting the first star for scoring that OT goal. Uh, Beauvillier getting him the second, and Nicholas Cromwell with two assists getting the third. So let's go ahead, buy two packs here, and we also get that free division title pack, which is nice. So let's go ahead, open those up, I'll meet you guys there. Yep, it is there. We got our one unopened pack for winning the Division 10 title. So uh, let's see if we can get anything good from this online season champions pack. There should be three items. I'm not sure if it's guaranteed a player in there, but we'll open this up. See what we get. We get Riley Smith, who is not too bad. Uh, Brock Nelson, as well as Patrick Nemeth. So nothing too great there, but we, I think we can use Brock Nelson and maybe Riley Smith. We'll send those guys to the collection. And let's go ahead to the store and buy those uh, four packs. Uh, since we can open up four 7,500 packs, we can open up just equivalent of two uh, of those 15k packs. We can open up one Series 2 Expansion Plus pack 
and one of these gold plus packs, which is what I'm going to be doing. So let's get this opened up. See if we can add some more good players into our team. Usually these uh, gold plus packs makes a huge difference for sure. So let's go ahead and just skip it. Uh, we get Eric Fair. Not the greatest gold rare player that we can get. Uh, let's keep going here. Uh, Brandon Bolig, Kevin Klein, nothing too special there. Essa Linden, uh, Lindell, sorry, and Brady, Braden Shen. I'm butchering these guys' names, but uh, Braden Shen's been in like every single Hot Roulette and Pack Squads team that I've made, so he's a very familiar face. And yeah, nothing too special, so send those to the collection, and let's go ahead and open up our, our Series 2 Expansion Plus Pack, and uh, we'll see if we can get a little bit more lucky than the Gold Plus Pack there. But uh, yep, we should hopefully get... I don't know, at least some Season 2 players, uh, Series 2 players, sorry. And maybe get some new synergies as well. Okay, so we got Paul Byron, 80 overall. That's pretty bad. Nick Paul, a couple of Pauls there. But nothing too special. Let's keep going. Craig Daniels. I guess some new uh, coaches with some new synergies is pretty good. But Kyle Palmieri is our first gold rare player. Not a bad one, but nothing too special. Uh, let's keep going. Any good rare players? I mean, Jason Spezza was good so far, and we got another Eric Fair, so I would probably use this Eric Fair over the gold one that we just got. Uh, Eero pa pa Pakarinen, sorry, and uh, TJ Brennan, a familiar face on the Toronto Marlies for sure. But anyways, nothing too great in this pack. We'll send these guys to the collection, and then we'll go ahead and build our team again. Okay guys, so I added in the new players into the team. I think we got a total of five rare gold players that I added in, into the offensive lineup. So right off the bat, we're adding in like five 85 plus players. So the team's already a lot better already. Uh, but I'll quickly go through the lineups just to show you guys what I added in. So uh, Braden Shen is now playing on the first line right wing spot with Jason Spezza. Uh, Eric Fair, Kyle Palmieri, and Brock Nelson's on the second line. Eric Fair actually has one of the highest face-offs in our lineup right now. He has 83 face-offs, so I decided just to throw him in there because I don't think it really matters anyways. Uh, we also have Ben Smith, Derek Broussard, and Shane Doan on the third line. We have Riley Smith, uh, David Steckel, who's just there for taking face-offs. He's got 90 face-offs, got to keep him in there. He's playing with David Deharnay as well. And there's pretty much no changes with the defensive lineup as well as the goaltenders or head coaches. Couldn't fill out any of the synergies, so... Our roster is looking pretty much the same other than five new gold rare players in our offensive lineup, which is still pretty huge. That should help us win some more Division 9 games. But that's about it for this episode of Pack Squads. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure to leave a like. I'm going to keep posting on these videos as soon as possible so you guys have more content to watch on YouTube. So that's about it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Pass it to Steckel there, nice. Cut in, beats off play, back to the point. There it is. Harold, yes! Harold ties it back up with 18 seconds left. What a huge goal. Oh man.